Come on, let's move out before the welcoming committee arrives. All available Hydra agents report for duty. I think I want to do that again. Ah, there you are. I've been expecting you. Oh, you have not. Quit trying to be cool. Okay. Maybe he was expecting us. Perhaps we can use claws lasers to our advantage. You win this round. We're clear. Quickly, after him. <clears throat> it appears that our path is blocked yet again. Gotta admit, these Hydra guys are pretty good at making barricades out of random junk. Stay focused. Look for something we can use to get past. Agents of Hydra, now is your chance. Attack! Attack! has returned. Hey, those crates look kind of useful. You're right. A well-aimed throw of my shield should get them down. Impressive throw, Captain Rogers. Hey, thanks. All right, a gravity booster. Here we go. Well, did that work? Probably should have given you guys a little heads up about that. My bad. Get me out of here. Okay, team, get ready. Claw's just up ahead. He will pay for his treachery. Why do I suddenly have a really bad feeling about this? You have made it this far, but no farther. I will eliminate you all! Stand down, Claw. You are only making this more difficult for yourself. Oh, you think so, T'Challa? We shall see about that.
Fools are testing my patience! Ugh, you are starting to get on my nerves! Uh-oh. Look out, guys! Zola? We need to land this bird before they convert the rest of the Vibranium. Baron Zemo. Another friend of yours? You could say that. Panther, get after Claw. We'll fix this guy. Got it. <laughs> Zemo! Captain America! It's been too long! Kang said you'd come calling! Did he now? Thank goodness for rocket power. Got a parachute? Good! So, you know how to fly this thing? Um... Sure, no problem. Whoa! Zemo's just up ahead. I see him. Company. Gotta try and shake them off somehow. <laughs> A lucky shot. Lucky, huh? We'll see about that. We're getting somewhere. Keep firing. No, no, this is not possible. It's nearly over. <laughs> he 
you at the spot, my little friends, did you? Where did these guys come from? Nice shooting. Nice mess. Huh. Greetings, friends. Miss Marvel gave tell of your peril. Captain Marvel and I will pursue Kang. Agreed. All head back to Avengers Mansion when you're done. After you? No. After you. <laughs> after her? A swamp? I've got this! <laughs> Looks like someone has beaten thee to it. Have at thee! Thor, no! Ow! My apologies. I mistook thee uh... for a hideous swamp creature. Huh? I mean, I, uh, Obviously a very uh... attractive hideous swamp <sighs> creature. I... Have you had your hair done? It looks... Um, it looks very swampy. I, I mean, swanky. <laughs> oh, thank the gods. A fight! Man thing? You're working with Kang now? Another one of Kang's goons? That guy just won't let up. Then nor shall we. <laughs> Wait, you drop your keys or something? He's below us. Beware. This is no ordinary downpour. Bravo, Carol? Any other bright ideas? Unhand me, creature! What manner of attack is this? Look out, they're below us! Yeah. <laughs> 
tree's branches. Are they illuminated? Yeah, I see it too. What is that? Worry about it later. Right now we gotta deal with this man... thing. Watch your feet! What manner of attack is this? Unhand me, creature! Man, this guy's tough. But I think we're starting to wear him down. Beware. This is no ordinary downpour. What in the name of... By Odin's bristly chest hair. The nexus of all realities. The gateway to every era. Then this beast was... Its guardian. Man-thing. A veritable thorn in my side since I dragged his festering swamp into Chronopolis. And the final defiant obstacle standing in the way of my master plan. So, bravo. You few have accomplished what an army of Vibranium soldiers could not. Oh. Ah! Die! What? Ah. 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 Code Red! Code Red! Everyone back to the mansion ASAP! Ah. Silence! Okay. Now is the time for tooth and claw. Now is the time for war. Let the mightiest rise up. Step forth and face me. For then I shall prove that I, Kang the Conqueror, am the greatest. For surely... There is no man who can stand in my way. Thanks, Wings. That guy was giving me a headache. It wasn't me. Something interfering with the signal. From... from outside. From beyond Chronopolis. It's too weak. I can't lock on. If we redirect the signal through the mansion's comms matrix, we can more than double the strength. Uh, Hank. Hand me that spanner. No. No. The other one. <laughs> but we'll still need a negative ion emitter to clear up the distortion, and that kind of tech isn't easy to find. I wonder. We sent Star-Lord and Drax to take bio-readings with a couple of scanners earlier. Could those devices not be reconfigured to locate a suitable emitter? Hmm. And with the amount of future tech in Chronopolis, I'd say our chances are good. Oh. What? Oh, Hank, don't talk with your mouth full. Sorry. Gamora, think you can track down your buddies? My pleasure. Rocket, Groot, let's go. I am Groot. Get moving, you bag of sticks. You need the exercise. us the Old West as Quill and Drax's last known location. Let's catch up to them and start looking for that... whatever it was called. 
A negative ion emitter. Huh. And, uh, are we just acting like strolling down from Manhattan to the Old West is just a normal thing we do now? I am Groot. <laughs> Maybe you've already seen it, but some trouble is going down near where you are. Okay, who wants to test me? Come on! My training never prepared me for this. Probably because it was in the stock market development. All this snow gear's a waste of money, huh? I need a change of scenery. Kang might be a few stars shy of the galaxy, but I have to admit, this is quite a view. I am Groot. No kidding. Almost a shame to try and fix it, huh? That dame trying to make her new light bulb work? I had more luck fixed up a table. I had more creeping into my apartment. And I live on the other side of town. The way I hear it, the Daily Bugle is one of the more dangerous places in town to work. Reckon it's a gangster hideout or something? Sit here and stand. Maybe I'll stand by the mini golf course later. Even if it does have that offensive statue of our great ruler. Maybe I could hold my breath just long enough to dig them out. This is the place, right? So where are those guys? And more importantly, where's my power source? I think I saw a saloon over there. Let's head over and ask around. There's the town saloon? Then let's mosey on in and see what we can find. Maybe wet our whistles while we're at it, eh? Nexus destroyed by Kang. Helped by the Avengers, my sources tell me. Sure, they didn't know they were helping Kang, but that's not the point, people. Because the heroes beat the Guardian of the Nexus Man-Thing, Kang was able to blast it into fragments, enabling him to bring Chronopolis into a single time zone. That's good news and bad news. The good news is we can now get out of Manhattan and see if the rest of Chronopolis has a decent golf course. The bad news is now every creep in Chronopolis can get into our city and slug it out with each other to see who's worthy of facing Kang. Okay, Avengers, you broke it, so what are you gonna do to fix it? Hmm, seems they've sent a team to the Old West to secure a power source to help boost a strange beyond Chronopolis signal of some kind. Good nap! We ain't playing no snap. What? You low down, dirty cheating swine. 
Now just hold on a minute. Gamora! Give me your scanner. You two are supposed to be taking readings. Oh yeah, I totally was. But then Drax found this place and it had music and- And tacos. Ugh. <sighs> we have to find a negative ion emitter. Your scanner should now pick it up. <sighs> now get out there and start searching. How does it work? See that blinky light? If it don't flash, you don't have it. If it does- Your blinky light lies. I do not have it. Outlaws! What is that? That, my fuzzy friend, is our power source. I am Monarch, the ultimate human machine interface, and more importantly, the law! Well, not in my town. Isn't that? Don't ask. This place gets weirder by the day. Bring it! Well, looky here. Got us some outlaws. 50,000 big ones to the first cowboy to put these criminals in chains! <laughs> Cowboys? I do not see any half-human bovine creatures. Huh. Guess looking for the emitter will have to wait. Excuse me, good folks, but did I just hear that raccoon talk? Oh, why am I always singled out? There's two aliens here as well, you know. Don't mind him. He's having a rough day. Oh, my apologies. Aha! That electric gizmo looks right up my street.
gonna get paid. As I hate to admit it, Modok's force field is pretty strong. You're right. I reckon we'll need something special to take him out. I believe we have found something. Yeah, looks that way. Think that sword of yours can help us out, Gamora? the signal what happened to fancy captain america eh, who cares probably mopping up the last bad guys let's find that emitter Iron Boot! great okay you guys keep searching i'll go rescue the log agreed we'll rendezvous back at the mansion I knew I recognized that trait. Come on, Arizona Annie. We got us some villains to catch. We sure do, kid cult. <clears throat> Mind if I tag along? Man, they just kidnapped my raccoon. And his houseplant. Why, sure, sugar. If y'all don't mind sharing. Mine? Why, it would be my pleasure, ma'am. Hold tight, sugar. Oh, 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 no! You okay, sugar? Here, let me help hey, you. What? what? Ow! <sighs> Glad you can make it, partner. Yeah, me too. This will be my first train journey in a little while. Ah, you are the. What was that? Need to find 
another way round. Looks that way. Uh, sorry, I didn't catch your name before. It's Cole, Kid Cole. Folks know me as something of an outlaw. What? The Kid Cole? Wow, I've read so many stories about you, man. You know, I'm something of a legendary outlaw myself. They call me Star Wars. Uh, sorry? Who? Oh? Well, that figures. Mr. Star-Lord. It definitely has its uses. Let's get across. Uh-oh. This doesn't exactly look safe. Careful you don't fall into those burning rings of fire, Star-Lord. Get me out of here! There's no limit to the scope of my cameo talent. Where's my award for best cameo? Hey, no. Ah! <laughs> 
get it. They sure were. But for real sway. Yeah! I am Groot. Glad to have you back. I just wish we'd managed to get that device before we sent it south covered in chickens. You mean this? Rocket, my man. <laughs> if you didn't smell like that, I would so kiss you right now. Okay, so how are we getting back? Aha! Uh -huh. Ah! Oh, oh, oh! Uh, no, 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 no. Excelsior! How are we holding up out there? We don't have the strength to take the fight to Kang yet. Aye. And Kang Citadel be protected by a mighty barrier. Whoa! What? Heads up! Oh, oh, oh. No. We got it! That end is radioactive, you what? genius. Hey, careful, you can't just... Look, big guy. If you couple your dynamic resonators with a sub-neutron accelerator... But that could lead to a lethal magnetic containment failure, which then... Oh, boo-hoo, you worry too much. Voila, one boosted receiver. Oh, Cosmo, good boy. Are you calling from nowhere? Cosmo, Pete, stop, stop. Pretty lady needed help. Pretty lady? Mm -hmm. Doesn't that dog live on that giant head of a dead celestial? <sighs> Something with that much energy could help us take out Kang's defenses. We're outside space and time, and I don't see a door into Chronopolis. No, Hank. But we could make one, using the nexus of all realities. I may have an ancient spell that could unify this energy and tear a hole into Chronopolis. Though I'd need to consult the tomes in my library. Neat idea, Doc. But that Nexus explosion was huge. Any remaining shards would have been scattered all across Chronopolis. It would take months to find them. Aye. Or mere moments. If we had the infinite sight of the mighty Heimdall. Asgard is out there, but it's not of our Thor's time. It looks practically apocalyptic. Then let us hope Heimdall still holds guard over the Bifrost Bridge. Okay, let's form up two teams and start to turn the tide on Kang. I pray that Heimdall and my father are safe. I've heard tell of much destruction in my homeland. Is it technically still uh, your homeland? I thought this Asgard was from a different region of time and space. Wherever it's from, let's hope we find at least one version of Heimdall who can help us. The observatory appears deserted. Let us take our search to my father's throne. Looks like the palace entrance is caved in. To pass this obstacle.
pity. With this cannon operational, perhaps we could use it. This looks like my specialty. Inside. If this is the situation out here, I dare not think what dangers may lurk inside the palace. As you can hear, Kang's Chronopolis has descended into a mad melee. It looks like it's curtains for us for sure. Our one sliver of hope is a plan to get into Kang's central citadel and take him down. <laughs> Sources tell me Wasp has secured contact with an ally on the distant nowhere. That's a giant head of a celestial for those of you not paying attention. Don't get too excited, though, as the offer of help has come from a dog. That's how desperate the Avengers are, folks. Cosmic canines aside, this spacehead could contain enough energy or tech or magic beans to put a dent in the defenses of that citadel. What our so-called heroes need are a pair of sharp eyes to find the fragments of the Nexus they had a hand in shattering. Odin, my king. The kingdom is lost. Our forces scattered. Enough! This destruction was brought about by those fools, the Warriors Three, defying Kang. We had a deal. Odin. I still know not why thou made such a pact. Brother! I, I mean, son. You're alive. Father, what is this madness? Thor, is it really you? Oh, father! Heimdall! Heimdall! Oof. Loki, how? We banished you into the abyss. <laughs> Kang plucked me from that demise. With his help, I sent Father on a fool's errand to find you after Manhattan was lost an age ago, leaving me to finally take my rightful place on the throne. Thor! It's coming down! As Guardians, finally I will exact my vengeance. Sort of foul beast. I'm going to take your realm, Thor! We shall see about that, Surtur. I, uh, believe he was talking to me. Actually, it's my realm at the moment. Not now, Loki. Sons of Muspel! Daughters of Fury! Monsters of the Flame! Our time has come! Sound the battle cry that all who live may hear it and despair! March to destruction! Much to the fall of Asgard! Nothing can dim the flames of Muspel! You will fail! What the heck are those things? Surtur's minions. Pesky beasts, but they are no match for us. What did I do to deserve that? Asgard has to offer. It would be a shame to waste them. We'd be poor hosts if we didn't offer Surtur a drink now, wouldn't we, brother?
the next few seconds. I'm keeping this. Anyone? Someone else is going to have to handle this. Such a clumsy attack. This is why I don't normally use swords. You can't miss with a hammer. Speedy fire department. Fastest in all the realms. Yes! I completed the mission! My reputation as a totally legit superhero continues!
See, brother. When we unite forces, brother. He snuck out on us. Ah, <sighs> families. Heimdall, thank the world tree you survived. <coughs> Mere rocks won't break me. We have much to discuss, and we require your aid, locating shards of the Nexus. Curious. Odin, I mean, Loki, was asking of the same. Then go with them. I will keep vigil here should Surtur return. You make a most worthy Thor. Let's regroup back in Manhattan. Finally! I've always wanted to visit Broadway. Wonderful out there, Ravonna. Chaos, carnage, and all at my hand. Ravonna, my little siege tower. I thought we'd arrange the window cleaners to come on a Thursday. What have I told you? Get out of the... Huh? Otherwise, you'll find yourselves looking for a new round! Yes, it's looking quite devastated already. Though the Avengers have yet to yield. It's almost as though they've been given a new hope. That can't be your Kangship. Who in this Chronopolis would be so foolish as to dare plot against you? Who indeed? No one, of course. You know, you two really don't need to come with me. The Sanctum is only down the street, and the Book of Ashanti is probably... Probably the kind of super important magic book that bad guys just can't get enough of stealing. It's been stolen before, right? I bet it's been stolen before. Well, maybe once. Then it's too important to send one person after. Let's quit yakking and go grab the thing. By the power of the Eye of Agamot! This is the Sanctum, right? Remember the secret knock doc? Yes, I think I can just about recall. Happening near you. Can you see it? Go teach those guys a lesson. Huh? Who needs door handles? One book of Ashanti coming right up. Just when you thought things couldn't get any strange around here, our city's heroes have come up with the most harebrained idea to defeat Kang this reporter has ever heard. It involves the help of Cosmo the Space Dog and the planet Nowhere, an ancient head of a giant space being on the other side of the galaxy. Tony Stark is convinced that there must be something on Nowhere able to bring down Kang's defenses. But to get it into Chronopolis, our heroes will need to find the shattered fragments of the Nexus, then have Doctor Strange stitch them back together. He needs some book full of magic mumbo-jumbo to help him. Why isn't he conjuring up a decent cup of joe, huh? New York is running out of coffee, people. Nice place, Doc. Oh, thank you. But it's Wong who has the eye for design. You are too kind, sir. It's mostly Swedish flatback. Wong, we need the Book of Vishanti. It may be our only hope against Kang. Very good, sir. Uh, could you please fetch it for me? There's nothing I would enjoy more, sir. But I have no idea where it is. You really should look after your things. I do look after... Can you just help me find it? Try in the mystical cabinet of Nisanti, behind the vacuum. If it's not in there, then try and think back to when you hid it. By the all-seeing... Oh, wait! I do remember something. I set five runic locks to conceal it. <laughs> 